Yo, John, what up, brother? All right. How did I not go to sleep? The hell. What the fuck? Sorry about that. Where were we? Oh, that's right. I just got my just got my ass back here after being kidnapped like bastards. Bastards kidnapped me. So now what do I do? I'm going to test out this uh, fast travel system that I discovered yesterday. Oh shit, I gotta shave. Look at my Grizzly A Grizzly Adams beard. God damn. God damn. <laughs> Go full Amish. Should I do it? No, I don't think he likes that. Oh shit, now that's manly. Yep, I'm doing it. Alright. That's a manly ass son of a bitch. 
Look at that. Doesn't get any more manly than that. No, it was, um... Good morning, Arthur. I don't remember what the fuck their names are. It's like O'Boyle or something like that, or... O'Driscoll? O'Driscoll boys. I believe. <laughs> hey, Mama D. Mama D's nuts. Real good, like better than usual. Well, I bathe just for you. I'm being genuine, Bill. So you talking to my horse? Right, <laughs> she is pretty. Oh, look at that fox skin still on my damn horse. Been waiting for you, Arthur. Well, I'm sorry to have kept you. Come on, let's get going. What's the plan? We're meeting a couple of the greys over at the saloon. They spoke to Bill about a job. Needing security. After the farce of stealing the horses for them, why are we doing this? Because we need to stay in with them and their pain. So what kind of security they want? We're about to find out. Now come on. This seemed legit to you, Bill? Sure. Dutch said we was to keep on dealing with them until we find this gold. Can we trust them? Can we trust anyone? Yeah. Let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them horses. And what did they afford in their fields? They don't know we had anything to do with that. Oh, that's so? Yeah. They think it was the Braithwaite's. Listen, I know these great boys a bit now. This is on the level. We're stuck in the middle of some ancient feud, but instead of playing both sides, we're being used by both of them. They were saying the Catherine Braithwaite. Hey, hold up. This don't feel right. Now it don't feel right. I could have told you. Oh. There was a trap. Ow. They killed that son of a bitch. I'm the sheriff, you son of a bitches. You can't shoot me, I'm the sheriff. What the fuck? I'm not supposed to be using guns in this town. What the hell? Fucker. What you get for being a bitch? Bitch ass trick. Oh, 
Fuck you. Oh, Ooh, right in the fucking face, though. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you, hussy. Oh, right in the finger, and I killed you for some reason. Hey, fuck off. What the fuck? What is this? All the townspeople coming out to kill me, too? The fuck? Where are these people coming from? Shot his head off. Fuck! Oh, right in the face. Fuckers. You want some too, bitch? Where you at? Stop shooting at me. It's fucked up, man. Fuck. This gun is so damn slow, but it's so powerful. Fuck you. Gun store? Oh! Oh, you trying to sneak? Fuck you. Get fucked on. Boy. Alright, let's go to the gun store. Fuck. Ow! What the fuck? Who's shooting me? Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Fuck you, bro. Listen. Yellow belly son bitch. Fucking dead now, aren't ya? Ow! Stop it! Fuck! Fuck! Ah! 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 Fuck! They're all shooting me. No shit, bro. What the fuck? How many times I gotta shoot you? I fucking shot you six times! What the fuck? Fuck you. Yellow belly son bitch. Jesus. I'm guessing my guns need to be cleaned again because they're doo doo right now. Fuck you, bitch. Jesus, there's so many. Where are they all coming from? Like, what the fuck? Am I killing the whole town? Am I am I killing the whole town right now? That's what I need to know. I don't think we should be killing the whole town. It seems like a bad idea. There's another motherfucker over here. We'll find him later. Come on. Sheriff Gray! You need to get a hold on this town. It's going to hell. Hey Yaro, what's happening? Yo, I'm, t I'm taking all the loot off these bodies. Fuck all these fuckers. I ain't walking out of here till I get my damn pay. I'm killing all these motherfuckers. Or I'm looting all these motherfuckers. I don't even care. It's a lot of money and a lot of good loot.
Yellow bellied some bitches. Oh shit, you got my buddy. Fuck. Took too damn long. You want us to come out? We'll come out! Yes. Oh, Bill! Guns on the ground, now! Both of you, don't do it! You know we can't do that! You put the gun down, Sheriff! I'll blow his brains out! You wanna join your little friend there, do you? Either way, you're a dead man. Morgan? Shit! Damn! I'm one badass son bitch. He was a good kid. Well, how the hell was I to know? Let me see. They set us up once before. They didn't like us. We destroyed their farm. Should I go on? Go easy on him, Morgan. He was out trying to find a lead. Same as you. Same as Hosea. All you do is complain when things don't work out. Except when it's your goddamn fault. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't give a damn about nobody but yourself. Oh, you act so high and mighty, but you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what, six months now? And all you ever done was complain. You can fight, but you can't think. You can't do either. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Bill, take the boy's body. Bury him proper someplace quiet. Mark you? Trust you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm just so frightened by you. Get out of my sight, pair of fools. John has been killed. Headshot half off in an ambush. Still no Confederate gold. But a shitload of trouble. Yo, audio.
Yo, what up, your name? Well, Dutch is going to be pissed. I'm guessing they're going to make us abandon this this town now. Damn yellow bellies. We think the Braithwaite woman took him. Oh. Like Kieran saw a couple of fellows sound like Braithwaite boys. Where's my son? If anything, uh, where is my son, Dutch Vandalin? We will find him. We will bring him back to you. And we will kill any fool that had the temerity to touch one hair on that boy's head. Abigail, you have my word. Just get me back, my son. I will get that boy back, so help me God. Right now. Dutch! We just heard about Jack. You need some extra guns? Yeah, why not? Micah, Kieran, anyone strange turns up, you kill them. Rest of you, let's ride. Okay, let's go get that boy back. They must have figured out what we was up to, Dutch. Yeah. We just got shot to hell by the Greys in town. I know. I heard about John, too. I don't want to even think about that right now. We have to focus on Jack. I swear, I'll kill everyone there. Easy, John. Try to stay calm. I'm fine. How the hell did they get to him? I don't know, but we are getting him back and they will pay. I promise you that. What about the gold? Nice audio, that's sick. I'm excited for it. They got Jack. I hate to break it to you, but I don't think there is any gold. Or if there is, it's hidden somewhere no one knows. <laughs> I've turned every stone. For Christ's sake, Hosea. After all that, another perfect scam. We underestimated them. No, they underestimated us. Enough talk. There is no point arguing how we got here. This is where we are. And we are going to fix it. So come on. Okay, get your heads right. Nobody makes a move until I say so. Should have stayed out of all of this. A bit late for that, ain't it? Quiet. We're going to fix this right now. Like they don't know we're coming. Arthur, 
Are you coming or what? We don't have all day. Arthur. Arthur, we can't do this without you. What the fuck? Oh. Come on. Let's get this done. John, you sure you're okay? Like I said, I'm fine. Follow my lead. Both these I don't have the right guns. What the fuck? Think they can ruin us? Well, let me switch my guns. There they are. Who steals a goddamn boy? I'm gonna let fly at those sons of bitches. John, I need you to stay calm. Get down here now, you inbred trash! What the hell do you want? Easy, John. We've come for the boy. You must have known we would. Shouldn't have messed with our business now, should you? Whatever complaint you have with us, alleged, or otherwise, that is a young boy. That is not the way you do things. Hand him over. Get the hell off our land. If you ain't gonna be civilized about this... What the fuck, dude? anybody ever restart the whole mission? <clears throat> Alright, that's much easier than trying to get into... Fuck, I gotta... You guys, I'm looting these bitches. I don't ever listen, but I'm lo I'm looting the motherfuckers. I just got two dollars off that fuck. These guys are rich. Yep, two more dollars. Gold pocket watch is another five dollars or ten dollars. Another two dollars. Hell yeah, I'm looting these bodies. You guys are all fucking rich. All right, that's enough. Another two dollars. Fucking brand new cowboy hat, poor bastard. Fuck, let me move you fuckers. 
What the fuck? They won't let me move. Fuck. That sucks. Ugh, I hate that. I want to search for their loot. Ah, shit. There's nobody else. What the fuck? Oh. Arthur, On this side? What? Oh, I shot his fucking head off. in this house for 120 years. We never had no problem except for Where Yankees. is the boy? Who took him? You killed my son! Oh, and I will surely kill the rest of them unless you start talking. Oh, I know your time. Common scum. Where is the boy? You filth. All right. We get her out uh, of here. Uh, what about them? Sure. Now let's get this hag out of time. Any more of our sons to deal with? No, I reckon they're all dead. I want to search, god dang it. Killer. Fuck, don't let me search shit here, man. It's very upsetting. There's got to be all kinds of valuable shit here. See? What the fuck? There's a money clip. Let me pick it up. Oh, it's cards. Fuck. Fuck. There's got to be so much valuable shit in here. It won't let me take none of it, man. They just want to burn to the ground. That's fucking short-sighted. 
At least take your profits first. What the fuck? I'm very upset. This is a mansion. There's got to be all kinds of valuable shit here. bodies I never liked you why'd you take the boy mrs. Braithwaite you stole the boys my are off limits you stole my horses ain't no rules in war mr. Matthews yes, yes that's it <laughs> where's the boys my sons gave him to Angelo Bronte so my guess is Saint Denis. Either there or on my boat to Italy. Let's go. Arthur, come on. What are we doing with her? Leave her. I told you she was crazy. <laughs> It's gonna work out, John. It's gonna work out. Listen to Dutch. Now, I don't expect you to understand this, but I have never been more proud of you than I am right now, brother. You're doing the right thing. If I don't get that boy back safe, I'm... She, she'll kill us all. I know, but looking at this, logically, well, that boy is fine. They took him to scare us. Nobody takes a boy to harm him. He's right, John. What do you think, Arthur? My boy will be fine, but... Well, of course Marston scared Rodden. We, we killed all those people. We stirred up all that trouble. <laughs> for nothing. No. No. Not for nothing. For living. Now, we get that boy back, and we go. Trust me. Hey, Dutch! We got a problem. Not a problem. Visitors. A solution. Good day, fine people. Mr. Vanderland. Mr. Matthews, I presume. And who are you? Rip Van Winkle. Huh. Good day, sir. Agent Milton, Pinkerton Detective Agency. Agent Ross. Ah, Mr. Morgan. Nice to see you again. And to what do we Oh, owe you can go back to the house later on? I thought it was I thought we were burning it down. Aware, but this this is a civilized land now. It pisses me off that we you can't loot while that whole thing is happening. Only to, to allow the likes of you to act like human dignity and basic decency was outmoded or not yet invented. This thing, it's done. This place ain't no such thing as civilized. It's man, so in love with greed he has forgotten himself and found only appetite. And as a consequence, that lets you take what you please, kill whom you please, and hang the rest of us? Who made you the messiah to these lost souls you've led so horribly astray? I'm nothing but a seeker, Mr. Milton. You ain't much of anything more than a killer, Mr. Vanderlind. But I came to make a deal. It's time. You come with me, and I give the rest of you three days to run off disappear and go and live like human beings someplace else you came for me risk life and limb in this den of low lives and oh, okay so that they might live and love ain't that fine <laughs> <laughs> i don't want to kill all these folk dutch just you 
In that case, it would be my honor to join you. Excuse me, friends. I have an appointment to keep with. I think your new friend should leave now, Dutch. You're making a big mistake, all of you. <laughs> yeah, dreadful. We have got something. Something to live and die for. How awful for us. Mr. Milton, stop following us. We'll be gone soon. I'm afraid I can't. And when I return, I'll be with 50 men. All of you will die. Run away from this place, you fools. Run! Come on. Get your damn hands off of me, boy. What now? We get out of here. All right, Mama D. Any ideas? You try not to get spoiled, are you? Old house, hidden in the swamps outside San Denis. I'm sure they'll find us eventually, but it should buy us a few days. A few days is all we need. There's a spot out by Shady Bell. Lenny and I got into that dispute with the previous occupiers. Place is well hidden. You and Arthur, right out to make sure no one else has moved in. Lenny, go follow those fools out of here. Make sure that they leave. And John. We'll get Jack back, and we'll get going. Rest of you, get packing! Come on, John. This is crazy. We'll get packed up, but we need a new spot off. Yeah. Follow me. I know the way. gonna be all right, John. We should be going for Jack. We will. We have to move everyone first before that bastard Milton comes back with an army. We ain't no use to Jack in jail. We're at the end of a road. Thief Sim? I don't even know what to think no more. Just gotta keep our... What's canny mean? Like corny? Smart? Are you joking? We made too much noise once again. We drew him right to us. I mean... How many people we killed in the past few weeks? Far too many. It's Dutch playing his games. Okay. Thief Sim basically Skyrim too. <laughs> two families. Master con men working their magic. They thought there was a lot of gold. Yeah, they thought there was money. Ain't there always? Look, Marston, I don't know what to tell you. Things don't always work out. That ain't nothing new. Jack's gone. We lost Sean. Mac, Dave. Oh, okay. Me, Jenny, and for what? We can't change what's done. We can only move on. Is it like a mobile game? We need to start learning from Thief our Sim. Come on, it ain't all bad. We've had a rocky run. We'll be okay. We'll get through. I guess so, Yarrow. Yeah. Dutch will fix it. Dutch will come up with a big plan. Right now, every plan gets us into worse trouble. We're getting further from where we're meant to be going. Now, you can't put all this on Dutch. You're worked up. Rightly so. Just don't get too far in your head with all this. You'll never get out. It's a goddamn mess. That poor kid. We chose this life. He didn't. I don't know. I think this life chose us. You, me, Dutch, Hosea. It's been a long time now. So has. What the fuck? <laughs> oh shit! Whoa! Hey! 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 What the fuck? You trying to shoot my? You trying to shoot my horse? Yo! Fuck you, bro! What the fuck? You shot my horse! Motherfucker! We don't have time for your games. Yo! He was straight up shooting my horse. Oh shit, I blew his fucking head off! What? Yo, I've never seen that before. What, what did I shoot him with? The double barrel? Oh damn, I blew his head off with this shotgun. Holy fuck. What the hell's your problem? Fuck you. 
motherfucker. Yo, have you ever seen that? I blew that guy's head clean off. That motherfucker was trying to kill my horse. That was so shady, he just tried to shoot him. What the fuck, yo? That was jacked up. I was talking about your ass. Life's changed. Sometimes. Like, why the fuck was that guy trying to kill my horse? That's so fucking lame. If we were ever who we thought we were. I'm gonna save it real quick. I don't want to lose my horse. Oh, I can't. Oh, audio, I don't... Are you saying my horse is about to get killed? Because I don't want to lose my horse. Fuck that guy for trying to kill my horse. Um, audio, were you going to tell me what you were going to tell me? I don't want to lose the horse, man. There's a way you can tell it to me without it being a spoiler. I would appreciate it. I didn't want to believe he was mine. You know, when I was lost on that mountain after Blackwater, part of me thought, All right, should be just down this path to the left here. So, yeah, I could just leave again and no one would ever know. But some wolves thought otherwise. Oh fuck, where is this witness? You're here now. This oh fuck ball. you man, you're gonna have to die I guess. Shouldn't have been a witness here. Oh fuck! <laughs> oh no! Did he die? Okay, he died. Good. Fucking moron. Get back on the horse and let's go! So, like you were saying before, as soon as we get the other safe, we'll find this Bronte and get Jack back. So what is this place? Plenty found it. Big old run-down plantation house. Another gang was holed up there for a while, but we sent them on their way. Probably moved on to one of their other hideouts once left. Where we got that dynamite for the bank job. That's it up ahead. Four walls and a roof. We're moving up in the world. You ain't seen inside it yet. Come on. The sooner we get this done, the better. You sure this place is empty? I ain't sure on nothing. All right. Let's leave the horses here and take a look. Do 
still some here. I can see that. Oh. God damn. Any more of you upstairs? I'm coming for you. You hear me? Where are you creeps hiding? Come out where I can shoot you. Oh, I'm gonna be real happy to shut hey, you up. Soon enough. You are some of the coward. Like you. The bounty hunters. The freedmen, the carpetbaggers, the army of criminals who stole our land and our government. I survived them all. Our fight will live on. Jesus. Okay, then. Oh, 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 his fucking head just melted. Oh, damn, son. You think you're tough, Yankee? Come in here and fight me like a man. That's it. How about we fight? We won't. Come on. <laughs> Oh, you shouldn't have put your gun down, stupid. You stupid son of a bitch. You stupid bat. Oh, God, his head just melted right off. Damn. Oh, I don't fight fair. Fuck you, man. Shouldn't have thought I was going to fight fair, bastard. <laughs> stupid son of a bitch. Oh, God, his head just melted. Oh, God. That's so graphic. Just doosh, fucking melted face. Remember to drop your gun in a gunfight? I know. Dumb bitch. Is like honor. The fuck is honor? I want the others walking into this. Can you grab that one there? Follow me. All right, this way. We'll dump the bodies in the swamp over there. Why are we only disposing of one body? Oh shit. Okay. I can deal with the rest of the bodies. You go meet up with the caravan. Guide them in. Alright, see you soon. Really? Oh, this is going to take for freaking ever, man. Ugh. So annoying. The bodies are floating. Oh, no. The fuck? Oh, 
Oh, they're gonna do the rest of it for me. Oh shit. Welcome home, all you to uh, my humble abode. We got fine living. I know, right? All the corpses and the alligators, it's paradise. I love it. Miss Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, would you two kindly work your magic? Arthur, take a ride with me. Sure. Come on. Don't you? Yes. Could I have a word with you? <clears throat> Not now. Come on, Arthur. But how long is this story mission bullshit going to go on? All I've got going on, and she wants to talk. Everything okay with you two? I got far more important things to worry about right now than Molly O'Shea. So, where are we going? To take a look at this eighth wonder of the civilized world, San Denis, I keep hearing about. According to the map, the road up this way should lead us right in there. Alright. I guess this day ain't over yet. Not quite. Good work back there, Arthur. Everything went okay? Few loose ends. That's a major. And John? About what you'd expect. He's taking it hard. We're going to get that boy back. Whatever it takes. I need you to start asking around in the city for Bronte. Subtly, of course. Public places. Maybe start with the saloons. Anyone who can put us in contact with him. Of course. What about the Pinkertons? I'm fairly sure nobody followed us. We moved out fast. We should be safe for a few days here. And then? I think we need to move a little further. Put some ocean between us and all of this. The mess with those two families. Losing Sean. I see things differently now. For a long time, I truly believed a paradise lay somewhere in the West for us. But I just don't know anymore. So we're leaving the country now? Maybe. I'm still thinking about it. Whatever we do, we'll need more money. In any case, we have more pressing matters to attend to first. Okay, there she is. A real city. The future. Big cities. What is this place? Always repellent. Exactly. What is there gonna be cars now? I'll find you in there. Go see what you can figure out. Yes. Shit. The heart of the Industrial Revolution, looks like. Chapter 4. Wow, all that bullshit was just Chapter 3. That's insane. Does anybody know how many chapters there are? this fucking place oh shit they just added on a whole new city next to the old city two endings what is this motherfucker BR Angelo Bronte oh shit is that some mafia shit bounty poster let's go do a bounty I haven't done a bounty in a really fucking long time. Oh. 
Poor little bastard. What? Because I hit a dog? It was a mistake. What the fuck? That's not a crime. That's not even a crime now. Sure as fuck wouldn't have been a crime in 1899 to hit a dog. There's literally no crimes on the books. Uh, or no legalities on the books pertaining to, to animals. It's kind of fucked up. Um... Animal cruelty, yes, but you can kill a dog. Basically. That's different than animal cruelty, though. Alright, let's get this bounty poster, I guess, real quick here. Make a So I conclude, you're a bounty hunter. May I direct you to the poster on the wall there? There's eight chapters. Audio, what were you going to tell me, dude? I don't want to lose my horse. Please tell me. You going after Lindsay Wofford? Go find me a waifu. Lindsay Wofford. Where the fuck is she? Oh, shit. She's all the way up there? The fuck? Guess we're going up there. I might be. Or I might just want to hang his poster up on my wall. Come on, girl. No! I don't want to do this mission. Don't force me to. Fuck you. No! No! Let me go! I love the sound of the horse clacking on pavement. It's kind of satisfying to the ears. Um, what mission though, dude? What mission? I need to know. Is there a way you can prevent it? I want to know how to prevent it. Oh shit, we're in fucking New Orleans. Yo, I just realized we're in fucking New Orleans. Damn. I've actually been on this street. And this is what it still looks like. These little slave houses, they're still fucking there. They're still there on this street. This street is double wide paved, two lane highway. But these fucking slave houses are still here. In this part of New Orleans. It's crazy, you go, through, you go from like really nice city to like fucking slave houses and big, big giant plantation farms. And there's people living in the slave houses now. Them things must be hella haunted. Fuck that. Hey there, mister. Near the end? Okay. Yeah, I heard from uh, Dale. Dale told me that they killed his horse. Alright, John. Take it easy, brother. What was it? A predator? Okay. Yeah. 
Don't be scared. Is it a fucking snake? I don't know what it is that's upsetting him. I don't see any predators. These shackles all soon. I'm a goner. Please. This is crazy. Just shoot the shackles. One bullet. That's all. There you go. Oh. oh thank God. Oh, well, I have waited to hear that noise for so long. Yeah, I bet. I I wish I could give you some money or well. You know, I might have something of interest. You know Ansberg? Well, some la di da rich folks bought up a little cabin up north of there. Very remote. You get me? You sure I'm the right person for this sort of information? I ain't saying nothing. Oh, I keep forgetting about these house robbery. Sweet. What? Quit the what you will. That's cool, girl. Die, Confucius. <laughs> Confucius, Ev. Moments of inspiration. Dang. That cleared off a lot of the map, this ride up here. Yeah. Gotta find this hussy. Headshot. That should be a perfect deer skin. What? Should be perfect. Oh. There's a headshot. What the fuck? Yeah. 
am I supposed to get in here? Oh, what the fuck? Okay, that's not too bad. I want to bring that bastard in alive. I'll do whatever I got to do to make that happen. I didn't realize that was Lindsay or else I wouldn't have shot his ass. Thought Lindsay was a woman. I forgot Lindsay can be a male's name. What cockadoodle do bullshit? Cockadoody bullshit. <laughs> this cockamamie bullshit, boy. Was it considered poor? That's just not right. Yep. <laughs> Lindsay Wofford, I got here a warrant for your arrest. Or the other thing, if it comes to it, <sighs> come away peacefully and you can live, Mr. Wofford. the fuck, dude? What the fuck? Oh my god, I can't... Are you serious? Can't get up the fucking stairs, dude? 
Fuck. What the fuck? What the fuck? When you have the last out, you're supposed to. Mm. When you have the lasso out, you're supposed to be able to sh um, swing your arm and automatically hog tie him. I don't know why it didn't work. No, I'm not sure where he's at, Dive. Dude, that makes me mad. That makes me really fucking mad. I had that. I had that done. Motherfucker. I do not surrender. I guess all that remains is to take you and damn you to hell. meeting you sweet I found a special cigarette card the guy I was talking about wanting them
Um. Okay. You goofball, blue. Oh shit. <laughs> that was too funny. Well, did he actually hurt a woman? Cuz yeah, that'll get that'll get you fucking more than terminated. That'll get you put in jail, dude.
push down and in. Oh, I hope the night folk get you, you son of a bitch, and hang you from a tree. Yeah, this is it. Damn the police. Damn every one of them. Traitors. Come on. You're a traitor, sir. Got a live one for you. Well, looky here. We got a genuine Lamont Raider in the building. <laughs> Make the poor fella comfortable in one of our cells. <laughs> Bet you ain't felt a bed in a while. Damn traitor's bed. Get me off of here. Calm down. Well, that's what they were, and not a penny more. Looks right. That's it, a hundred dollars. Jeez. Oh shit. What the fuck? What? No! What the fuck, man? Ugh. Not fair. Oh my god, I just lost a hundred dollars plus. Fuck that. I'm loading my save. This is probably the same save file that I just had. Oh well. <laughs> Fuck, it is. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. The fuck those bastards want with me anyways. I don't understand what I did to piss them off. Oh, there's gators. Let's go get a gator.
the fuck, dude? Shoot this little ass one. What the fuck? Perfect alligator skin. Dope. Oh shit. That was a frog? Oh shit. That's funny. Are you serious? I didn't realize that, man. Oh, okay. No wonder. I was like wondering why I wasn't getting perfect pelts and shit. Do I have to always study it before getting the perfect pelt? Okay. Okay. Oh, I just tried that plan over there, and it was like a gunshot. Oh. Remember one with the pink flowers? Tiny little bastard. Steer clear. Thanks, mister. I owe you my life. Some things you learn the hard way. Yeah. You can... You can say that again. Can't take this way around. I don't know. Oh, okay. I see. Can you study them after they're dead or you have to study them when they're alive? Shit, man, that makes it a lot harder, dude. Especially when you're chasing deer and shit, you have to study them while they're fucking alive. That's not cool. Not cool at all, man. This camp could do with a few improvements. 
Why don't you take a look at my ideas? Don't forget to go hunting, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, I hear you. This will help the stew. This should keep us fully stocked. This is a decent pelt. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Mr. Arthur, I told Dutch I feel I should tell you. I saw some of Combs boys riding around. Down here? What they want? I have no idea. Do they see you? I don't think so. Okay. Well, thanks for letting me know, Karen. Mm-hmm. Oh, really? Shit, I didn't know that. Where's the stew pot, man? I always have a hard time finding the damn stew pot. Where is it? I don't fucking see it. I don't see the damn stew pot anywhere. Oh, it's supposed to be right here, that's why. Fuckers. Motherfuckers. The ledger's upstairs now? What the fuck? I got a house now, eh? A bedroom and everything. Oh yeah, I meant to go to sleep. Fuck.
I guess. Oh, what am I doing? <sighs> I meant to use the fast travel. I'm being such a moron right now. Okay, Mr. Morgan. Sir, can I bother you for a minute of your time? Can I tell you a little about what we're doing here? Sure. Less than a minute, I promise. Uh, we're trying to raise money to build an expansion to the Quincy Harris Memorial Hall, a shelter for homeless veterans and their families. Can you help? A donation of $20 would put us well on our way. Monsieur? Twenty dollars ain't no chicken feed, but sure, I can help you out. That's very kind. What is your name, sir? Arthur Morgan. Your donation will be acknowledged on a founder's plaque when the building is completed. You have a great day, Mr. Morgan. Hmm, guys, I don't know. Maybe I should just stop streaming for the night. Come on! This is kind of pathetic. Out of the way! Once you support our veterans and their families, think of what they sacrificed for everybody. Hmm. 
stick him up, cowboy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, real funny, Dutch. Oh, I thought so. So, here we are in the strange land of papists and rapists. America's very own Gamora. This yeah, city's all of the same to me. So, how you get on? I've been asking around about Mr. Bronte. From what I've heard, this establishment is our best lead, but I haven't had any joy in there so far. So, I should just give it a shot? I think so. Just keep it cool. You know me? I'll meet you back here in on. Funny you should say that. Well, you know how it is. I told them, I say, that's the state of Lemoyne for you. America's dirty little French secret. <laughs> That's why we Hello. love it. Born and raised. Mm. Well, I'll get you in a second. Not unless we all get washed away. <laughs> Every year they say that's gonna happen. It ain't happened yet. <laughs> Let me tell you something. The rest of the states, they lucky to have us. If it wasn't for us, they'd probably run back to Britain with the tail between their legs. Can I help? You look like a whiskey man. Sure. Dollar, please. For a whiskey? Oh, that's the real stuff. From Scotland. I already have it, audio. Okay. Here, have one for yourself. Well, right, thank you. So, mister, if I ask you a question, you ever hear of a fellow by the name of Bronte? <laughs> Who's asking? Me. I'm asking. No, leave it, Fred. What do you mean, leave it? Look, I don't know what business you're in, but leave it, Fred. You and your pal that was in here before. Bronte? Angelo Bronte. Mr. Big, Mr. Italian, spaghetti-eating, long streak of piss big. He makes my skin quark. I'm so squally a cocksucker. <laughs> You know what I mean, friend? Where can I find him? Oh, well, I reckon you talk to them kids in the alley, they'll know, I guess. Oh, and friend, you, you be careful now. Immigrants, they're not to be trusted. Who the hell you think you are? The fuck? That <laughs> guy was being so weird. Apologies. Excuse me. Excuse me, partner. How's it going? I'm doing very well. That's good. All the best, then. I une prochaine fois. Come on now, this something doesn't become you. You Pardon me, but have you seen any kids around this way? Yeah, I think I heard a few in the other courtyard up ahead. You can get through on the left there. So are you done with the pilot treatment now? No. Hey! Hey, you got a cigarette, mister? Maybe. Huh? I'm looking for a fellow named Angelo Bronte. I tell you. I know him. Everyone knows him. Where is he? We'll take you to him. What it'll cost. I reckon I can pay. Five dollars. Where's he live? New York? I'm an entrepreneur. If you don't want to pay, then I don't want to walk. Oh, man. Five bread. Here. Come on. This away. Let's go, mister. You coming, Cleet? <laughs> this away. Let's go, mister. Oh, one
stay close. Easy to get lost around here. Come on, then. You new to the city, mister? Pretty much. Don't worry. No one knows it as good as me and Cleet. Is that right? Hope you won't need his services, but you got the doctor on the corner there. Nice enough, fella. That's Baird and Schreiber on the right there. Famous bookstore. Not that I'm much of a reader myself. Now over here's a real piece of art. That's the Church of the Holy Blessed Virgin, mister. Model on the famous church in Toulouse, which is in France. You been to Toulouse, mister? No. We're Catholics here, mister. Ain't Baptist or nothing. My mama says they used to burn Protestants and all, but, uh... Bet they don't have nothing so fine where you come from, mister. Look at them fine steeples. Hey, hey, <laughs> you little pair of shit. Let's go. That fellow looks angry. Stop, damn it. Oh shit. How the shit went that way? Thanks for the help, friend. You did not. You know, I kind of miss old Bob Tate. Hey, you see a kid about 14 years old run through here? Why, yes, we did. He went around the corner there. Damn snitch! That's enough. Come here. Hey! More on! You ain't got no luck. I'm gonna shoot this kid. Fuck. What the fuck, dude? The control. Oh my god. Trolls are so What's damn annoying. Wrong, Give me my thing, boy. What are you talking about, friend? I ain't your friend. But that kid is. And he robbed from me. Now give me back my stuff and take me to Angelo Bronte. Senor Bronte. That kid was gonna show me before he robbed me. Now. Come on. You new in town, mister? Come on. Mr. Bronte's got a lot of friends, mister, but I ain't never seen you. We ain't friends. <laughs> you don't like no one, mister. Mr. Bronte, he's got fine hair. He got a beautiful house, and I am proud to work for him. He got 50 men, mister. Why are you gonna care a thing about you? I just wanna speak with you. <laughs> I'm sure you do, mister. You and them friends of yours been asking about him all over town. He's been mighty disrespected. Bunch of muddy Yankees in town asking questions. 
Well, you and your friend should pay him a visit, mister. He's got a big house on Flavian Street opposite the park. Hey, Yoko. Now, get out of here. I want you to have this. Thanks, friend. It's nice to give something instead of just begging. Morning, mister. I ain't asking for money like a goddamn worm. Groveling here in the dirt. Where you been? Getting robbed? Who by? Bunch of children. <laughs> I won't inquire anymore. But I found Mr. Bronte. Seems to be some Italian Mr. Big in town. Everybody knows him, but nobody wants to talk about him. Apparently lives in a big house on Flavian Street, opposite the park. Huh. Good work. What now? We go pay him a visit. I'll get John. You meet us there. Whatever it takes, we need to get that boy back. I cannot decide which I like less. The swamps or the city. Both are full of parasites, reptiles, and slime. We're a long way east of land we know, far from real open country. Buy me a drink, mon ami. Excusez-moi. 
Dis-moi. Sure, what you want? Brandy. Two brandies, bud. It's two dollars a glass. Oh, better be good then. Mm. It's the best. Thank you. Santé. <laughs> ah, it's quite a country you're building here, eh? Well, me personally? Hmm? I don't know. What do you do? Mostly, I just shoot people. Oh, how very American of you. I love it. What do you do? Oh, mostly I... I pose, I show off, I complain. Oh, how very friend. I know. <laughs> I am ridiculous. <laughs> I have <laughs> been all over the what world. The fuck? I have seen sights, and I have discovered the one eternal truth that I am a pies, um, how do you say, old ass. Mm? Asshole? Mm, that too. That too. <laughs> mm. Well, at least you have some self-knowledge. <laughs> Where were you on your journey? Mm. All the civilized world. Painting my little pictures, meeting the locals, you know. You a painter? No. I'm a whole ass. I thought we had covered this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, mm. but you paint. Not according to salons at Paris. No. According to them, I cannot draw, I cannot paint, and I should go away. And so I went away. You miss Paris? Hmm, that smelly, filthy place with old buildings and ghosts and shit and French people. I have that right here. Hmm? I guess so. Hmm. You know, uh... Arthur. Charles. You know Arthur? Don't believe in art. Hmm. It's lies. Believe in women. They are the truth. Art is lies, but the vagina, that is truth. Breasts is truth. Art. So it is. You say so. Oh, trust me, I've tried both. One is better. Much better. <sighs> so, I uh, must be boring you. Uh, but, here. What is it? Uh, it's just a little doodle. Uh, you know, entirely worthless, unless you want to wipe your bottom with it. But I wanted to say thank you for the drinks. Well, that's very kind, Charles. Mm, no matter. Good meeting you. Mm. Was it fucking Monet or some shit? What's up, chop? You count, sir. I'm a humble brother, a penitent monk, not a priest, and you're a magnificent bit of work. You may have made some some poor choices, but which of us hasn't? <laughs> you have no idea. But you do, and God does, and that's enough for me and for him. We shall see. That we shall, sir. But why don't you hedge your bets and give two bits to the poor? There are so many who will go hungry tonight. Sure. Bless you, sir. How you getting on, anyhow? These are a somewhat apathetic lot, I'm afraid. Mm. My, um, my mentor says that America is designed to induce apathy in people. It's a wonderful insight. He must be a wise man, your mentor. <laughs> well, sometimes he's a downright fool. But usually he's the best man I know. That's wonderful. The, the thing is, I'm, well, poverty will always be with us, but slavery, I, I thought we had banished that. But saint Denis is acting as a staging post for shipping slaves out to some of the islands. I don't believe it. It's 1899. Maybe you should take a look for yourself. I've heard that the pawnbroker down the block around the corner, the one with the green door, 
Well, they say he sells more than forlorn trinkets. Help the poor. Mama D left. I think she didn't want to get any spoilers, and everybody else fucking left after. Um, she said hi if you ever showed up. <laughs> said to say hi if you ever showed up. That was her words. Probably shouldn't be searching this place while the guy's still here. A bit of a strange question, but you heard tell of slavers around here, buddy? What? Where are they? Who? People you're hiding. I know they're here. Don't lie to me. Please, they made me do it. I was always good to them, but they, they, they forced me to do it, sir, I swear. Where are they? Uh, the, there's a door behind the bookcase there. Just put the big red book on the skirt of crossbreeding by Harold McDougall. Not a bad man. That's sick. Oh, hello? Shh, gadgety, gadgety. Oh, ¿Quién es? Por favor, ayúdanos. Help, please. Por favor. Now don't worry. I'm on your side. ¿Quién eres? Please, I'm on your side. It's gonna be okay. Is that it? Gracias, señor. Muchas gracias. Come with me. Don't worry. You're gonna be all right now. I promise. That's it. Come on. Oh shit! The shop Thanks owner's you. gone. This way. How much farther? Poor bastards. Brother, Brother Dorkin's friend, Arthur, Arthur Morgan. Come on, you were right. I found these two imprisoned in that shop. Oh my, that's, well, they are blessed to have met you, Arthur. Trust me in that, they're very unusual. I don't think they speak much English. My brothers, come, let's go get something to eat. Manger, comida, please. Hey, you forgot this? Oh, yes, thank you, I, uh, here. Payment for your services. I could not have freed these men myself. Give it to the poor, brother. Thank you. I will. That must be a like a really important moment. Come, come, come. Because I did that thing twice. I often work at the old church on Gasper Street. Try to find out if I'd be greedy or if I'd be um, giving.
I'm guessing that's going to affect the ending of the game. <clears throat> because with it having slowed down time like that, I assume it's uh, fairly important. But do you know where I might find some moonshine? What? Moonshine. You no, know, strong liquor. Over strong. Why, you want to get over drunk? <laughs> no, no, it's not for drinking. <laughs> what is it for? Oh, I just need some. Well, as luck would have it, you are in the legal hooch capital of America. There's plenty of real booze here. But for shine, well, I'm guessing you need to go out into the woods. I mean, I know you'd have to go out into the woods. Now listen. Don't need that much. How much? About a hundred gallons. Oh, shine? Yes, thereabouts. Why? Oh, all right, I'm trying. I'm building a machine. A machine of love. A hundred gallons of hooch and love's gonna come pretty cheap. Please, friend. I'll pay. Just, just, just bring it here. Or go call us. Well, if anyone knows who's moving that kind of shine, it'll be that stagecoach guy. Roads? Oh, hell no. Nah. What the fuck, Nuggets? Probably, Chop, probably. That's the part that didn't make sense about the uh, Howdy, first Red Dead. They should have been having cars already. And you didn't really see them until you got to the end of the first game. Or the end of the very end of the game. Horse, what the fuck? You done fucked up. What the fuck are you doing? It's gonna be a long ride. that guy. And they actually had cars before the Model T too. In Germany the first, I believe the first steam powered cars were available in like 1890. Um, they actually had a, a car that ran off a hit and miss engine. They had the first modern um, Uh, valve piston engines in like 1895 and I think the first car was built by somebody else other than Ford somebody in Pennsylvania I believe like 1897 to 98 somewhere in there
Oh, this is such a long ass trip, dude. Yeah, I'd be down with that. I'd be down with that. Well, finally we're here. Open your eyes now. Here's your stop. Appreciate the ride. See you around. Yeah, I know, Chop. I'm kind of mad about it, honestly. Uh, there really isn't any other mode that's com comparable, and the new fucking thing that they added is really lame. It's terrible. I hate it. it does not compare with fucking Respawn. They're a bunch of bastards, dude. That's what they are. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. And there's no 50-50, there's no nothing, like, give me something at least that's similar. And Ethan and Ret uh, Chester were like, well, the 30-30 mode's similar, like, it's not at all, really. At least with 50-50 mode, like, they're all trash, but on the 30-30 mode, they're not trash, really. What the hell is wrong with I know, you? exactly. And on solo mode, dude, I was obviously doing a time trial 
And I was about to get the last motherfucking one. And this motherfucker followed me up. I, dude, I was standing on top of a bridge next to Shifty Shafts. Clearly, like, just walking around, like, doing the time trial. I didn't have any guns. This guy fucking, like, chased me down from, from far away and killed me. For, like, for no fucking reason. Like, I, I walked past the chest. So he knew I wasn't fucking trying to play the game, like... Fucking loser, man. Dude, I tried to get his name so I could send him a message to tell him to go fucking... ...die or something, but I couldn't get his name fast enough. What? Dude, that's bullshit. The autopilot put a fucking warrant on me. That's fucking dumb. Because it ran over that guy. That gave me a fucking bounty. That's so retarded. Fucking autopilot, man. I know, me too. That's just how they fucking are, dude. Like, yep. a lot of people are just really good at the game now. Easy. Whoa. I know, dude. Really fucking annoying. Like, really fucking annoying. Permanent deathmatch mode? Oh, you mean like, uh, like how they used to do it in, um, or like how they, like in Quake or whatever? What the fuck? Why did the checkpoint go away? Why did the marker go away? I'm confused. I'm so confused right now. Did I break the moonshine or some shit? What the fuck? Hey. Fuck. Why did the mission checkpoint go away? Fuck. How am I supposed to know where to go, man? It's fucking bullshit, dude. Oh, here we go. 
Where the fuck is the professor, though? You gotta give me a goddamn marker. Like, what in the hell? I don't think it did, Chop. I don't know. I think for some reason the game just glitched out because it just said it, but then... Let's see if I have a save file. I do not. Okay. Great. <sighs> How the fuck am I supposed to remember where this motherfucker was? See, I knew it. Oh. Wow. Because of the fucking... The horse running over that guy in fucking New Orleans failed me the mission. Fuck you, man. Fuck this game. Fuck. Fuck. I'm never going to be able to complete this mission now. It's not going to be possible because I already have the warrant. Oh, what the fuck, man. I'm going to have to go to the post office and see if I can uh, pay it before this wagon comes. Fuck. Maybe it'll wait for me. Maybe the wagon will wait for me. Dude, I know. It should have just auto-failed the mission when I got the warrant in the first place. That's fucking dumb. It's really fucking dumb, dude. Yeah. Oh shit. Now the check mark is gone. I fucked up. I know. Yeah, it's really bad programming actually. Happy to assist you in a moment. Liberty is worth every penny. Hello, how can I help? Thanks, mister. Okay, girl. I know. Yeah, and all it did was it barely knocked him over. I was slow trotting, dude. It's fucking slow trotting. Now I have to try to remember where that spot was. 
It's like up here somewhere or some shit. I don't even know. It was up near this bridge, I think. The fuck? Yeah, there's a girl. Mania. Wow, this thing gets, this horse gets really dirty really fast in this fucking town. It just said I had to brush him again. The fuck? Jesus, this muddy, dirty roads make him dirty fast. Fuck, is this the bridge? I can't tell. Was this the bridge? Yeah. I don't think it was. No, I don't think that was it. Oh shit, yeah, that was definitely it. Well, mission's fucked forever now. Yeah, I didn't have I didn't drive over all this shit last time, no way. No way, no how. I don't think so. Unless this was it. Yeah, actually this was it. Okay then. Wonder if I can still get it to spawn. Fuck. Don't think so. Maybe I can look at that map, that that note again. Yeah, tell me about it, chop.
Blue Water Marsh. Yeah, this is it. Fuck. Yeah, we missed it. Fuck me, man. That sucks, dude. I guess. I just noticed something. That note said drive careful with it. Maybe it did maybe it did break, bro. Maybe it did break. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay. Well, this mission's fucked then. This mission's totally fucked then. Because I'm not going to be able to finish it if they're going to say that I can't because I had a bounty. Fucking lame, dude. What? Are you... <sighs> what the fuck? What did I just preload? Oh my gosh. I don't even know what I just did. I think I just undid like a bunch of progress or something. No, I wasn't in rows. What the fuck? I'm so confused right now. I was only here when I came to get that tip from that motherfucker at the prison. I'm so confused right now. Why? Brother Dorkins. Oh, motherfucker. Yeah, I just lost a shit ton of progress. Oh, no, it said only 20 minutes. What the fuck? I'm so confused right now. I already did that Brother Dorkins bullshit. What is this bullshit mission? How did I miss this? What you fools up to? Is Mr. Black's fault? His fault to Darky White. Well, I don't know why they call him that. Look at him. Don't you start now. I'll knock the color clean off you. Come on. And I'll right. tall you, you lily liver. Enough. Huh. You two fools look like you've just run off a chain gang. You I never had this up. mission before. What, what the fuck? Starving. They got bounty posters for us all over town. And we can't go into town to get supplies. Say, mister, maybe you can do us fools a favor. We ain't bad guys at all. He's okay. Even for a darkie. Shut it, you pasty face streak of piss. Yeah, I had it up to here with you. No. Do your goddamn favor what you want. Maybe you can go into town and take down them wanted posters of us. Okay. Maybe meet us back at the campfire in the woods and tell us how you did. Uh, maybe bring us a little bite to eat. Don't push your luck. Nice fella. Yeah, you love nice fellas. Don't you start up again. Just shut up. You shut up! I'm going to go see if that guy will spawn the... I'm gonna see if that guy will sp if that guy will spawn the dialogue of giving me the bounty mission, I or I mean, uh, giving me the stranger uh, 
mission. Hopefully it will. With you in a moment. Doesn't look like it. Sorry, I, I don't have anything for you right now, but I'm working on it. Alden, hey, come back and you know see me later. About these runaways? Off Can the I chain so maybe I already have it then. I'm fucking confused, dude. I'm confused. Oh, I already have it. So why the fuck isn't it marked on the map then? Oh, it is. Ah, there it is. All right, sweet titties. Hell yeah. Okay, now I can do it. All right, cool, cool. Well, guess you don't know everything. So long. Mr. Black is white and Mr. White is black. That's hilarious. There's five of them? Hello there. Hello there. The fuck? How am I supposed to find them all? I just have to go looking around town and see if I can fucking find them all. The fuck? That's jacked up, man. I don't want to do all that. Sounds like a waste of time, if you ask me. I'm guessing there's some inside the general store. <laughs> you bastard! I need a buck hair, you bastard! What the fuck? I'm supposed to just guess where they are, I guess. It's kind of stupid. I don't like it. I don't like. Oh, there's one. I don't like it one bit though. I have to guess where they're at. Hello, Mister. Hey, I need to get to that poster behind you. Will you move a little? <laughs> I will not. Deputy put up plenty. Go get one of those. Please, mister, I'll just reach by. It won't take but a second. I'm leaning on it. Find one that ain't in use. Hey, move. I need that post. Oh, I'll move, all right. How's this for moving? How about we get back to it? What the Sam hell is with you? Bounty hunting bastard. Uh, 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 no damn manners. <laughs> All right, there we go. Now I got a bounty of my own. Great. Poor little dog, what the fuck? Little dog just wanted to stop me from being a bad boy. I don't see no more posters. Ah, oh, there's one. <laughs> yeah, he done got fucked up. Dude, I don't want to look for fucking four, two more of these things, man. What in the hell's 
wrong with you? Fuck off, bruh. <laughs> what the hell's wrong with you? Just fine. Marlene? Still with us. Have fun then. Where the hell could the last one possibly be? Where could it be? Let's see. Gunsmith. I ain't going gunsmith yet. Did I? I don't know if I did or not. I don't think I did. Well, thought I might have seen the last of you. All right, what do you want? I mean, since I took your son, your fake son away, you creepy bastard. Fuck are all these posters? Where else could they have put them? What I, do for? I mean, really, where else could they have put them? Let's do it. to our creator we pay respect to the dead maybe at the church they wouldn't dare put him at the church oh father what do we say about a man who lost his way so awfully he carries Kelly's that awful word with him sir we're in a moment of grief hey hey mister a brave man, undone by pride, doomed to a life of sin and vice. Let us pray for this man, O oh Father. Provide him mercy. Amen. I'm just trying to find these god dang posters. Like, what the hell, man? Where else could they be? I've looked everywhere. Wait, what's this bag place thing? Oh, that's the general store? I already went in there. There weren't shit in there. It seems like a giant waste of time, if you ask me. Dude, I know, Chop. It's really fucking annoying, too. What the fuck, dude? There's only so many buildings in this town, and I've already checked every damn one of them. There's n and and it's supposed to show up when you get within a few feet of it, so I'm not I'm not understanding how I'm missing these at this point. This fucking guy with the Gavin shit still. <gasps> I didn't go to the saloon. Fuck me. Of course, that's where they're at. Oh, there it is. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Mister, I need that poster. There's been a recall. I weren't born yesterday. This one's mine. You take you the liberties, boy. Own. What's happening? Shut up, bitch. 
match. Next time, I'm going to use my friend. Boy, all right, all right. This is not going to do with me. Where the hell are you? Hopefully nobody saw that. Come on. Yeah, they would have chopped. They would have. That's for damn sure. The fucked up part is I just became a criminal to get these goddamn posters for these other criminals. Like, what the fuck? Wait, what? There's another one now in here? What the fuck? So I didn't have to fuck with that guy? Is that what you're telling me? Oh, son of a bitch. Mark Johnson. The fuck is that? You looking at that poster? They're an ugly old Oh, it's a different bounty, I guess. Never mind. Exactly, Chop. Exactly. That was fucking dumb. I guess maybe you're not meant to do all the stranger missions, you know? Maybe that's the point. You should uh, analyze risk reward and, you know, not do them if it seems like it's a bad idea. Has anyone seen an Englishman called Gavin? This fucking guy. Gavin? You still haven't found him? Nope. But I won't give up. He's lost. One morning, I just woke up and he wasn't there. Someone must have taken him. Oh, maybe he just left. Gavin? <laughs> no. No. We were best mates. I mean, really, best mates. He he'd never leave me. Never. Oh, I am so worried. Gav! <laughs> Gav! You really think standing there Gav! and calling out his name is going to get you the Where best results? Where are you? Okay. Okay, my girl. I know. Quite a price on you boys. It is so unfair. I, I didn't do nothing. Well, they said you was wanted for murder. It was a murder? It was self-defense. And you killed a farmer? Well, firstly, I would have, but he died before I could. And secondly, well, he had it coming. He... I don't like to say. Well... Ain't no business of mine. Here's the posters. Thanks, partner. That's that, then. That's that. Free at last. Free from you, at least. Well, not quite. No? We should wait a while first, see if anyone's on our trail. Aw, oh, they love each other. Too risky to split up now. They just don't want to admit it. So sweet. Oh, it looks like my bounty's gone in St. Denis. Fucking fantastic. I'm glad. Now I can just... Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, fuck. Alright, well, I'm gonna have to avoid that. 
wanted area because that's going to set off another mission. You know, it's not really too hard for frenemies to just become friends after a while. Exactly, job. Hey, Mister, can you help me? Please help me. My damn heart's died on me, and my legs are hurting, and I need to get home. Where the fuck do you live, bitch? I don't have time for all that. My God, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just, I can't. I can't. I never really realized that there were stars. That's pretty damn cool. That would have been the opposite of honor, though, choppers. <laughs> uh, wonder if you can just hog tie strangers and shit. You probably can, right? <laughs> just go up to random people, hog tie them for no reason. Just kill strangers. I know. There we go. Lucky, it's your lucky day, Mr. Boar.
shit. What did I just hit? What? Oh. It was a rat. Probably, Chop, probably. They're bo wait, they're both poor? The fuck? Whoa. What the fuck? I'll only shoot him. Oh, damn. Oh, poor bastard. Okay. Alright, let's go. Oh, fuck. Oh, right in the face, though. Alright, let's go. Dude, Chop, you, you missed it earlier. I was using the double barrel shotgun. You can actually shoot their heads completely off their body. They just disappear like they never existed in the first place. It's insane, bro. I did it to like four guys in a row with the double barreled shotgun. It was all sorts of fucked up. And then this fucking guy, this one guy killed himself to avoid me. He's like, oh, I knew you were coming. And he pulled out his fucking shotgun, or he pulled out his uh, pistol and shot himself in the head. It's fucked up. I'm like all paranoid now about breaking this loot. It's for a very good cause. Uh, my name is Professor Andrew Bell III. Perhaps you've heard of me. <laughs> Can't say that I have. Oh, I'm an inventor. Uh, maybe you've read about me. 
Uh, I don't read much. Oh, oh, well, that's too bad. Oh, yes. <laughs> you got my money. <clears throat> oh, well, it, it is the most wonderful invention, friend. Oh, you, sir, have done a great All deal. All I've done is get some creep a lot of drink. <laughs> Creepers, excellent no, nonsense. Now, you've helped me develop the most humane machine imaginable, a way to induce calmness to all those troubled souls, a way to end the barbarity of a public hanging. Oh, so, so humane. What are you talking about? The electric chair. What? It's a chair full of electricity. Quite fascinating. It calmly and peacefully dispatches the sinners uh, to face judgment. Yes, judgment. Yeah. Where is it? Well, uh, it's in my laboratory. What does that have to do with moonshine? It's a, a demonstration. A public one. Huh. Uh, do you know the police chief? Hmm? As well as anyone. Oh, wonderful. Perhaps you can encourage him to let me demonstrate the chair. It will help bring this town into the next century. Yes, could you do that? Hmm? I am not sure, Chop. I'm a little confused about that part. To be honest with you. Maybe to run the generator? Or enough generators to... Or enough engines to power electricity to the chair? Considering New Orleans would not have had um, electricity. Um, well, looks like they did have electricity. Huh, I don't know. Maybe they didn't have enough electricity to power an electric chair. Back then. <laughs> who knows who he's testing it out on I don't know if I want to find that out watch it turns out he's the one who's buying the slaves from the fucking guy at the pawn shop just to just to test his device on them that would be fucked up I almost just killed him. Or I almost just... Fuck. That would have sucked. Dude, I was looking away and I just looked back. And I almost ran down a fucking cop. That would have fucking made me so mad right now. Because it probably would have fucked this mission up. And that's why this mission glitches out. Because you can't have a warrant, I betcha. Since you have to talk to the cop. After, I bet you anything that's what it is. Good job. You got some real so problems, know that? Our home police house. <clears throat> Chief, I'm representing the inventor of a humane execution machine. An electric chair. And he, uh, wants <clears throat> to demonstrate his invention here. Ah, I'm familiar with the man and his work. Tell you what, I'll give you a permit. But it's going to cost you $100 in fees. Okay, well, the price is fair. Here you go. And here, sir, is your permit. A pen and unusual formalities, of course, such as... Uh, Finding a suitable candidate for humane dispatchment? I'll tell that to the professor. Good luck. Jesus, my horse is dirty as fuck again. This part of town makes the horse dirty like twice as fast or some shit.
I love the sound of the horse on the cobble. It's really satisfying for some reason. Sister, my friend, Mr. Morgan. Oh, sir. Brother Dorkings told me about the wonderful thing you did. Oh, he talks a lot of nonsense. No offense. None taken. None taken at all. Hey, stop! These kids that are worse! Don't hurt him, please! Fucking shitting me. Oh, I hate these fucking missions. Is that my track? Oh, fuck. You all right? Oh, how Leo. Kid did this? Hey, you know him? He robbed me. Which way you go? That way. Thank you. Where's my watch, you little weasel? I don't know nothing about no damn watch. Last Saturday, I saw you steal it with my own... Hey, you! Why don't you leave the boy alone? What's it to do with you? I can hit a lot harder than you. I promise you that. All right, forget it. This shit ain't even worth my time. Thanks, mister. Some company, mister? No. You sure? Hey. What? I don't know you. This is Downs? Oh, no. Not you. Get away. How? Now. I mean, uh, hey, help. Uh, help. Hold on. This man is bothering me. Now. Someone help me. Officer, help. What the fuck? I know, dude. Like, what the fuck? Oh, shit. Mm. 
barely noticed that cop until the last possible second. Excuse me, father. Sister, I got your cross. <gasps> you didn't. No, I did. Oh, I hope the boy... He's fine, physically. Mentally, he's a piece of work, but who am I to say? Brother Dorkins was right about you. You are the most wonderful man. Brother Dorkins is greatly deceived, I'm afraid, but I'm happy to help a little. Thank you. You see, it's a thing, but... My mother gave it to me when I was a novice, shortly before she passed. You are the most wonderful man. Oh, excuse me, Father. Sister, enjoy your day. See, Father? Brother Dorkins found him. I told you. Brother Dorkins was What? Why do I have a bounty? Man, that's some bullshit. Dude, I don't get it. <clears throat> hey there, girl. I'm sure she's fixing to come back up again in the story at some point. The fuck is that? Oh, photo studio. She. Professor, Professor Andrew Bell the third. That's it. So, Wish I could, bro. The chief says you can test out your machine, oh. pending the usual formalities. And what are they? Uh, finding a suitable uh, subject. Ah, funny you should mention. This fellow here, he seems sturdy enough, and he's guilty as sin. Wilson J. McDaniels, wanted for murder, bigamy, and. Immoral animal husbandry. What's that? The mind shudders. Uh, here, find him for me and help me put him out of his misery. Uh. What the fuck, man? Oh, this mission just never ends. Oh my... That's so fucking far.
piece of shit. Yeah. I just kind of wanted to go because I got shit to do. But. It's alright, we can finish this off. Fuck! God damn. Not gonna fucking like pay me or anything. Fucking douchebag. Yeah, pretty much, chap. Miss the fucking head, dude. Fuck me. Easy, girl. I'm nearly there. Fuck.
Yep. Uh, yeah, if you get them with an arrow and it's a perfect buck, it'll work, but... Well, let me study it. What the fuck? Rifle for a clean kill. Fuck. Fuck. Goddamn mission just cucked me hard. He must be down in this cave. Wait, there's not a cave? What the fuck? Is there? I keep thinking these rocks are gonna be caves and shit, but they're not. What the fuck? I'm here for Wilson McDaniel. Bastard! Hey, fuck off! Damn! Jesus Christmas! Fuck! Jesus. Oh shit, what the fuck? Who the fuck are you, bitch? Fuck you. Fuck! Go! What the fuck? Bitch! Fuck you! What? How do you get out of that? I'm about to get zappy, zap, zappied. Boyo. I know, Chop, exactly. That's what that's what's dumb. I guess you can get him if you get him right in the heart. It still counts as a good pelt, but if you hit him in the stomach or some shit, it counts as a poor or or good instead of perfect. Which is annoying as fuck, dude. <laughs> yeah. Yes, roll down the hill, bitch. Roll down the hill. Fuck you. Oh shit, that would have just killed him, IRL. Or fucked him up bad. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh shit, the way he just slow rolled down the mountain, though. Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit. No, fuck you, game. You can rot down there. <laughs> I know you liked that one, Chop. Seen his ass slow roll down the damn mountain. That's true. Take my horse, what the fuck?
Oh, that's cool. The horses do eat random bushes. I never saw that before. I was thinking it was kind of stupid that you had to feed your horse all the time because whenever I've been on horses, they just eat whatever the fuck they want. Yeah, I probably could have done that job, but when I go back there, they'll be fucking gone. Shit, big beautiful deer. You was in animal husbandry, am I right? Oh fuck, there's a buck there I wanna get. He's a long scope rifle? I have no idea. I guess, well, you're supposed to be, audio said you're supposed to do it stationary. Like, go out hunting on foot. Like, how you'd really be hunting in real life. Scope them out from a distance and uh, shoot them before they know you're there. Use your animal uh, scent cover lotion. And get them that way. Plus, there's also bait you can use to bait them in. I'm going to have to spend the whole stream hunting tomorrow or some shit because I want to get all the upgrades and shit that I need. The fuck? Oh, fuck you. Uh-huh. Yeah, me too. Well, you'll 
be happy to know we ain't got far to go. Hold on tight now. <laughs> Man, what a long fucking drive to get this fucker. Seriously. Oh shit, he got hit. He must have got shot by those uh, bastards. Damn. I'm glad they didn't kill him, that would have sucked. humane electric ending facilitator now, there will be money enough for you sir yeah, let's hope All right, let's get our our um our poor unfortunate ready for the demonstration oh do come and watch it'll be amazing come along what we're going by cart Can I ride with you? Oh, okay, I guess not. Fuck, he's leaving. What the fuck? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Please refrain from using my actual name in here. Myra? How do you know my name? Uh, I don't know. It doesn't ring a bell. I don't know. Oh, ha ha ha. Hilarious. It's on Twitch, Chop. Um, would you give me some room? What's your problem? 
The fuck? Really? Excuse me while I carry on with this. Both of these nuts. God oh, damn it. No. Dude, I don't understand. So I guess I don't get to see this guy get fried? I'm confused. Imagine dragging these nuts all over your face? Yeah, ha ha ha. No, I, dude, I don't know who the fuck this is. It's gotta be somebody who knows me, though. Has to be a friend. Okay. Who are you in Hush, man? What the fuck? Oh, McQueen. Well, this is quite depressing. After all that shit, I don't get to see somebody get electrocuted? Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Me too, chat, me too.
Alright. Well, I don't understand. Maybe this mission takes a day to, like, develop or some shit. Oh. I don't want to miss it, but... I gotta go, though, guys. I will see y'all tomorrow. Chop. Anybody else watching? Thank you guys for being here. I will see you tomorrow. Everyone stay safe. Have a great rest of your night. Peace.